Softing. In this video, we are going to explain what is and how to test an end to end link. An end to end link describes a twisted pair cabling configuration that is fundamentally different from the conventional permanent link or channel that is used in enterprise LAN networks, data centers, and residential cabling. A permanent link comprises of a cable which acts on both ends of the cable, usually running from a patch panel interact to a telecommunication outlet. The permanent link may also include a consolidation point. A channel is the complete horizontal cabling path including the permanent link, and any cross connects end or patch cords attached to both sides of the link. In an industrial environment, where machines are directly connected to machines or network devices such as switches without using additional patch cords. An end-to-end -end link is used for these applications. The simplest end-to-end -end link comprises of one piece of cable that has plugs on both sides of the cable, and can also consist of several segments. The simplest configuration looks like a patch cord but with additional specifications which makes it different from a patch cable. For example, an end-to-end -end link has different performance criteria to a patch cable. An end-to-end -end link can be built using stranded or solid wires, while patch cables are solely made of stranded wires. An end-to-end -end link cable can have two or four pairs, while patch cables typically consist of four pairs. Up to five segments can be linked together using bulkhead couplers to form an end-to-end -end link. The total link length can be up to 100 meters for solid wires and up to 70 meters for stranded wires. An end-to-end -end link can come pre-built from vendors, or can be assembled in the field using field terminated plugs or sockets. Some end-to-end -end link configurations can contain segments with plugs or sockets at the cable ends. An end-to-end -end link can comprise up to 5 segments and 6 connections. For example, if two connections are closer than 10 cm apart, they count as one connection. If two connections are more than 10 cm apart, they count as two connections. In some configurations, segments can consist of a jack, cable and a socket, which is similar to a consolidation point. In some configurations, segments can consist of two sockets and a cable, which is similar to a permanent link. Since it is very common in industrial applications to build a customized link, for example, between a machine and the control rack, field termination of the plugs of the end-to-end -end link becomes important. There are two methods to perform field testing that can be applied for end-to-end -end links. Qualification test uses the IEEE 100 megabits per second, 1000 megabits per second, or 10 gigabits per second Ethernet as a test criteria. A set of testers send Ethernet packets at full line rate and simply test if all packets arrive OK. These testers do not discriminate between permanent link, channel or end-to-end. -end. Certification test uses international cabling standards as the reference and measures low frequency and radio frequency parameters at a specified accuracy. Most cabling test specifications refer to certification test as the required test method. Since the ends of an end-to-end -end link can be terminated in the field, it must be ensured that both ends of the link are included in the measurement. The red dotted lines depict the reference plane, which delimits the part of the cabling that is included within the measurement. It is important that the testers and any measurement cables are not included, but the sockets at the end of the measurement cables are included in the measurement. IEC 14763-4 specifies that to achieve accurate and repeatable measurements, test heads with special reference grade performance are required. In a conventional channel link measurement, patch cables are directly connected to channel adapters on the measurement device. The definition of a channel link measurement does not include the first and last connector of a link under test. Hence the plug of the patch cable that is inserted into the tester will not be tested. For an end-to-end -end link configuration, this would mean that any field terminated connectors will not be included in the measurement. Therefore, any field termination error other than a crude wire map fault would not be found. Wire expert can be used to perform an end-to-end -end link test with M12 decoded, M12X coded, 
and RG45 ends. Insert the industrial Ethernet adapters to the local and remote units of Wire Expert. Press the Setup button on the local unit. Select Test Settings. Test Limits. And select End to End. Depending on the measurement category, Class D or Class E. Select 2, 3, 4, 5, or 6 connections. The correct nominal velocity propagation, or NVP, needs to be indicated to obtain accurate length measurements. Selecting the type of connector is only for informational purposes. It will not influence the measurement accuracy. The limit sets are dependent from the number of pairs in a cable to be used. Two pair configurations can be found in generic UTP and generic shielded options. One pair configuration can be created as a custom cable by selecting Customize Cable and select Add. Enter the name of the custom cable. Select the pairing that will be used. If a two pair cable has to be created, select pairs 1, 2, and 3, 6 for RJ45 and M12 decoded connectors. Select if the cable is a shielded or unshielded construction. Select the cable type. This selection has no influence to the test results, but it will be documented in the test report. Hence, it is important to select the correct option to be documented for future references. Enter the correct NVP value. This is the same option in the test settings. Press OK to proceed. Select to use the custom cable. Perform a set reference using the Terra to Terra reference cord provided in the kit. Press the Tools button on the local unit. Select Set Reference. And Next button to proceed. Remove the reference cord and connect the adapter cables for testing after setting reference. Use the Export PC software for Wire Expert to evaluate end to end measurements and generate into PDF reports recognized by global cable and connector manufacturers. Have a look at the other videos or visit our website to explore the other various features of WireXpert. Thanks for watching.